Well, my name's Graham Walker and these two people in front of me take no introduction. But I'll tell you anyway, it's Harry and Amy from Look North. What are you doing in Sheffield? Though? I'll tell Thanks. you what we're doing here. We're going to get absolutely soaked to Graham. And it's great that my favourite region newspaper, The Star, is covering the event as well. Because look at this turnout today. Fantastic. Thank you, Sheffield. Very good, very good. Now, really I, about I can see some stocks there. What's happening? Not looking forward to this one. We are going to be sponged in the stocks. We're asking people to pop some money in the bucket, grab a soggy sponge and lob it as hard as they can at our faces. And do you know what Amy just told me? She's put on her special waterproof mascara. Let's hope there it works. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I haven't. Now, I'm just going to show people the big five. There's a, a graphic up here. Yeah. Uh, and there's also a, a text uh, a message uh, to donate five pound. So it's uh, you text Bear to 70405? That's right. I mean, we've already done quite a few challenges, uh, including the now infamous assault course, which assaulted me more than anything else, I think. Uh, and then tomorrow we're going caving in the Dales, and then on Friday, Hudson and me are getting back together. Three-legged walk between... Uddersfield and Halifax, how about that? Well, you know what, if anybody wants to come and see that, uh, we've got, again, we've just got a little bit of video, Harry. Can you just uh, tell people here this is where you're going then? Yeah, that's yeah. right. We're, we're going to all these places. What we need is people to turn up in there, hundreds, thousands, we hope, because the, the, the last part of it is a horrendous 2,000 feet climb, and that's going to be really tough, especially with my back being in the state it's in. Uh, it's going to be very interesting, so uh, please come out. Peace Hall, if you have never been to Peace Hall, it's well worth a visit, it's fantastic. And, and of course it's well. all about the big five, the challenges, and yeah. we're just going to remind people again. So that's five challenges in five days. Day one was a Krypton Factor Assault Course, the hardest military obstacle course in the country, we can definitely vouch for that. Yeah. Uh, day two was uh, making Donuts. cupcakes. Well, I think we've got some pictures here friends, actually. We've yeah. got the you've actually in the fetching Edward as yeah. well. <laughs> so nearly a thousand donuts we have to decorate. Uh, that wasn't an easy challenge actually. No. Today we're in the stocks. Yeah, yeah. and tomorrow Good we're caving Sheffield. and then Friday Harry and Paul are gonna be tied together again for a fifteen mile walk. All right, well listen, without any further ado, I think it's time to get you in the stocks. And I think we've got Dickie Bird here to get you wet. Good old Dickie's well. gonna start. Yeah. Graham, thank you. All right, thanks nice a lot. So if you want to come down here folks, uh, I think this is happening and through until about 1pm, right. here we are in Barker's Pool, which as you can see is just outside Sheffield City Hall. A uh, lot of activity here today as well because the graduations are on the way, so this is going to get very busy. As you can see we've got the stocks, uh, and Harry's getting himself in there. Here you're seeing the magic of TV unfolding before your very eyes. This is doing some uh, footage for tonight. BBC Look North, uh, where of course they're going to be promoting uh, Children in Need, which is this Friday. Um, and as part of that, uh, we've been telling you about the, uh, the five challenges uh, that have been taking place uh, with uh, uh, Ari and Amy and the rest of the team. So here we go, in the stocks. So what you do? Oh, when you right. do that, that, then you put it down. Yeah. So I mean, as, as you did before. Yeah. We'll lift it up. We'll do it all in one take, and then we'll just do a couple of the couple ways of hands going. This, of course, is also to uh, celebrate Radio <laughs> Sheffield's 50th anniversary, which is today. Um, uh, and as part of that, uh, the five challenges by uh, the Look North team is here in Sheffield. Uh, this is raise money for children in need, and to do that, donate five pound text to bear to seven zero four zero five. So let's get uh, Harry and Amy in the stores. <laughs> Is your neck too big, Amy? Your head needs to be too firm. No, it's your oh, head that's stupid. Yeah. <laughs> that's it. That's it. That's there it. we go. Now this will kill the fire. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> this is horrible. <laughs> 
Why, why the stocks? Why okay, not another let's, challenge? Let's, let's <laughs> yeah. Why? I don't know. I asked myself the same question. I think just while just while waiting for the fun to begin and everybody's getting their selfies and their pictures, I'm just going to go over here and have a, a quick chat with some other people that uh, we want to have a quick word with. We've got Putz here. I've got to, Toby. Toby! They're going to kill Harry Gresham. Yeah, I'm sure that they nearly have done. They nearly chopped his head off. I know. Yeah. So, no, what brings you up here? Contractual obligations. What, to wet <laughs> Harry Gresham's head with a sponge? Precisely. No, it's children in need, of course, it comes down every, every year. And they always buy into it to look north. And the, the fact that Harry puts himself through it every year, I have no idea why he does. So I've come here today to throw a wet sponge into Amy Garcia's face. There's, there's a fair few other people here that I'm recognising as well. Them all, look at them all, look I'm at looking them all. at all this, yeah. Bernie. I'm washing round it. <laughs> yeah, I'm washing round it. This from, um, the Barnsley contingent and the liveish audience have donated this sponge together with the staff of BBC Radio Sheffield. Uh, just to uh, sponsor the fact that when I throw this slow left arm uh, with the wind uh, sponge, It'll, it'll hold more water than the brand new ones they bought for the event. This has been in the system now for several years. You know, this is a great cause, isn't it? Children in need, but it's also a very special day for Sheffield. It's the 50th anniversary of Radio oh, Sheffield. How important is it to celebrate that? What a wonderful coincidence. I mean, I was still at school 50 years ago. He, he lied. <laughs> Yeah, back in the back in the 60s when I first came to this area and got familiar with Radio Sheffield, it's been the sort of it's, it's an iconic uh, uh, statement, isn't it? It's always there in the background. Yeah. Lucky, lucky people. And, and here we are today to uh, uh, Harry's head. Here we are in Barker's Pool, ready to do our darndest uh, with our uh, Radio Sheffield sponge yeah. to make Harry ever so glad that he's going back to Leeds this afternoon. Well, we're looking out for that. Can't All right, thanks a lot. Thanks, Bernie. As we can see, we're just waiting for this to get underway. There's already quite a, a large crowd that's built up down here in Barker's Pool. Uh, and this is for children in need, of course, and we've got uh, BBC Look North presenters. Harry Gration and Amy Garcia are about to stick their heads in that stocks if they can get them in there. I've just seen a bit of struggle trying to do that. Uh, and then they're going to have wet sponges thrown at them for children in need. Um, got some other people down here that I just want to say hello to as well. Uh, I've noticed Dickie Bird. Dickie, how are you? <laughs> Now, now, uh, I'll have I'm good, mate. I'm very good, I'm very good. And it's good to see you down here. Now, listen, we know you're you standing in the middle of the wicket, but what's your right arm like? Are you going to throw a sponge? I'm going to, I think, uh, unknown to Harry, uh, and I think I'll get a bucket of water and then... Uh, You'll not miss? I'll not miss. <laughs> I haven't had him in that position for years, have I? <laughs> Now, the, this, is, this, is a, this is a great event for children in need. Yeah. You're a big charity supporter yourself. In yeah. fact, you were telling me, aside, I mean, your own charity, you've got uh, some huge donations that you make, and you've already made a lot. Well, I'm, I, I, I'm, the, 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 the donations I'm making to Great Ormond Street Hospital and to uh, Barsley Hospital, uh, Tiny Arts, and also to Leeds General, are from my own pocket. Yeah. I've given what to, I've given uh, thirty odd thousand to Great Ormond Street Hospital for six children. I've given seventy thousand to uh, Barsley General Tiny Arts for six babies, and I'm going to give one to uh, Leeds General thirty thousand. Well, well, well done, and uh, yeah. congratulations on fantastic yeah. and, uh, support there. And I'm supporting this. Well, you always children, are. I mean, children, children need, need it's every year raises yeah, millions. Millions, it's great, and, yeah. great. Charity, isn't it? Yeah, Dickie? yeah. And as we can see, look, these guys there. You don't fancy getting in the stocks then? No, I'm going to let. Uh, I'll fill a bucket full of water, I think. And then <laughs> look at Grayson. And and that, uh, look at him. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I'm going to go around and we'll get, we're going to see this. Uh, we're going to see this unfold. Uh, and you're going to throw one, are you? Oh, then, yeah, yeah. All oh, yeah. right, okay, let's we'll get down here then. So there's the first official sponge being thrown, and it's a miss. Keep it going, that's good. <laughs> Can I just borrow you for one more yeah, thing? Yeah, yeah. If you grab a sponge. 
time looking. Come on, it's your turn next. <laughs> all the way, to, yeah, all the way. To, I'd like you to just uh, dip it in for me. Your turn next, Joe. Yeah. That's it. And you've got to go. I am. Okay. And so Who said that was awesome. nothing? Off we go. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all for coming, that was great. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, Dickie Bird's just been telling us he's not going to miss, he's going to use a bucket of water on him, apparently, so it's a good job. That... <laughs> oh, here's Dickie, the man himself. Come on, Dickie, let's see how you do it. I won't miss. I won't miss. Here we go. Here we go. Day. I won't miss the grace. I've got it, I've got to have it. I've got it. That's if I get at it. Oh dear. Oh dear. Come on, give me your then. <laughs> right in the cup. <laughs> Come on, Dickie. Now the fish is in. Do you want this? Yeah, go on, throw it. Come on! 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 And so as Amy, that's uh, Dickie Bird joining in the fun here down at uh, Barker's Pool for children in need. Uh, Look North's uh, five challenges where they're trying to raise money this week in, event, uh, in advance of uh, children in need. The big five, donate five pound text to bear to seven or four or five. Uh, there, there, there must be better jobs than this. There must be. And he's my mate. <laughs> he was. <laughs> mate. How did that feel, Dicky? Hey? How did that feel? It was marvellous <laughs> to get Harry. I never thought that I'd get Harry there on the socks. And what do you think of what they're doing for children in need? Marvellous, marvellous. It's a good cause, a tremendous cause. And uh, yeah, I hope that people give, you know, which I know they will, and I think they will raise quite a bit. I'm sure they will. That, that's how they'll look when they're cleaned up and fresh yeah. up for tonight on TV. And just remind people yeah, fine, donate fine. £5 pound text to bear to 7405. Uh, for children in need, uh, I, and that's uh, by following BBC Look North all this week. Uh, my name's Graham Walker, here I am in Barker's Pool, uh, where um, there's fantastic children in need. Uh, fundraiser's taking place, if you get down here before one o'clock, there's still a chance to throw a wet sponge at your two favourite uh, Look North presenters, Harry Gration and Amy Garcia. Uh, thanks a lot guys, uh, and we'll uh, catch up with you soon.